All right, hello, fun, and welcome back to my Red Dead Redemption 2 series, where today we are back here in the camp where, oh boy, I am a little worried about our future, because before starting the episode today, I was having a little gander at the map to see what all we had in store for us. And it looks like we've got a mission for the Reverend down here, one for Javier up here, and one which we're gonna actually do today for Uncle, to do the Polite Society Valentine-style thing. So uh, yeah, that's what we're gonna do today because I figured that'll lead us to Valentine where we can then help Javier, and then at some point go and help the good Reverend. But what I noticed while looking at our encampment is, um. Yeah, there's apparently a morale system I did not know about or anticipate, and apparently the ammunition, the provisions, and the health supplies all affect it. Like if I actually, if I can click that, yeah, there we go. From all of these, people in the camp can take supplies, and if they get too low, the camp morale lowers. Does that mean... We have to keep the camp in supply of ammunition, medical supplies, and provisions. Now, I understand if we go camping, you know, it's good to bring it back to the butcher to help out the camp, and that'll fill up the or the uh, the meat supplies there. But do we seriously have to bring back bullets and tonics, too? Or does the... As long as there's camp donations, will that handle that? I don't know. And I probably won't find out today because, yeah, let's just go, let's go help Uncle. I'll have to figure that out off camera because that, oh God, dude, what does morale even do? How will that affect the camp? Will bad things happen? I don't know. I don't know. Well, let's, uh, let's go say hi to Uncle and uh, check out whatever's over here. Camp funds are 45 bucks, eh? Yeah, bring Pearson animals. Can I not, Good can day. I not run in the camp? Morning to you too. Yeah, I can't seem to run in the camp. Hmm. All right, where's this guy? Oh, there we go. I can run now. Hello. Oh, hi. Hi, Uncle. How are you? Let's wake up. Ooh, stew is being prepared. Check again after noon. Nice. Wake him. Wake up, you. Ow, I got ow, missions to do. Careful not to work yourself to death there, Uncle. I was thinking. Uh, Where are you now? Very well. Eventually. So, while the rest of us are busy stealing... Killing, lying. I mean, we haven't done any of those things survive. yet today. You get to think all day. Well, it's a strange world we live in, Arthur Morgan. It really is. It really is. You want to head into town? See if we can find anything out. Sure. I got some errands to run. Great. Go check the horses are ready. <sighs> ha! Take that! If you gonna take the old man into town, you can take I mean, sure. too? Why not? Oh, what you got planned? Nothing. We'll find something for y'all to do. We always do. We're bored out of our minds. Been cooped up here for two weeks now. Karen's about ready to murder Grimshaw. Ha! <laughs> well, can Miss do Grimshaw it. spare you? <sighs> can Miss Grimshaw spare you? What's happened to you, Arthur? Three young, healthy women want you to take mm -hmm. them a robin. and you're worried about house chores. Let's go! Girl's got a point there, Arthur. Girl's got a point. Come on, then. Let's roll, ladies. I can't believe we're going to see civilization. Feels I mean, like civilization yeah. in very big quotes, I feel. Very embodiment of civilization. <laughs> ladies are going to love it. Okay, then. Let's go. All right. Now Off we go. Take a left. Ah, that's a slow cart. Okay, over here. Let's try not to break a wagon wheel this time. The ladies comfortable back there? Is this too fast? I don't know. Watch. Ooh, I should probably slow down for this. Oh, oh. <laughs> hey. <laughs> don't wanna don't wanna turn wide and hit that rock. That uh that probably would have been very bad for us. Ladies, sing us a song. <laughs> You're asking him to sing a song? Really? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Okay. Okay, so they're just gonna. Okay, they're just singing more. Got telegraph poles. Wagon! Let's steal it. Hi, other wagon! Don't mind me, just merging onto the main thoroughfare. He really is. Oh, oh god, he's gone. He's gone. Oh boy. Uh, hi! Is one of you gonna get that fella's horse? I mean, sure. Very serious. Uh, that means it's me. All right, fine. Hi there, fella. Let's see what's going on. 
Some bagel, really. Hi. Right can, we, there, can we talk? Oh, Yo. Hey, you couldn't help me get my other horse back from over there, could you? Yeah, sure. You get that one. I'll get this one. Oh yeah, I gotta. Uh, yeah, uh, help. Sure, no problem. Thanks. It's the white one over there. Yeah, I, I kind of gathered. Kind of gathered. All right, let's go get this thing. Calm him down. All right, lock on. And G. Whoa, there. Easy. Easy. That's all right. It's all right, horse. You're not as nice as mine, but you know it'll work. Study. Let's study. Okay. We can show info. Cool. All right. So I've calmed him. We can now go and pat him, and then lead him over. Okay. Okay. Hide info. Don't need that anymore. Hi there, you. I want to pat you. Who's a good horse? Who's a good working horse? And lead. All right. Wonderful. Looks like the guy got the other uh, one up and going. Can I run? No, I cannot run. Probably wouldn't be good after calming this horse down, would it? Also, make sure we're not going to get run over by a train as I walk this poor horse across. That would have been bad. <laughs> also hilarious, but mainly bad. Mainly bad. Hi there, fella. Got your horse. Yum. You going to be all right now? I'm going to have to hook it up for you because it's going to be annoying. Here. Here you go. You're a gentleman, sir. A gentleman. Thank you. Uh, not really. I was just trying to impress the women. <laughs> well, anyway, thank you. That works, too. Okay, so apparently we have an honor system and can help people to do things. Interesting. All right, back on the cart. Ladies. Oh, let's go. Yeah, yeah, working on it. Let's not run into the horse there. Turn here we go. Regular old fairy godmother there, Arthur. What's that <laughs> supposed to mean? It means you got a heart. A small one, perhaps, hidden deep inside, but a real one. <laughs> and you have a like pulse of old blizzard. Blizzards have hearts. Well, Arthur, I'm proud of you. Train. To be honest, if you lot hadn't been here, I probably would have robbed him. <laughs> <laughs> well, you did. <laughs> oh, my God, we have a train. Can we run it down and steal more things yeah. from it? All right, but we seem to have found the town. Hi, other cart. Let's slow down here. Let's not run into one another. This cart really only seems to have two speeds. Super slow and maybe a bit too fast. Woo! Smell those sheep. <laughs> or is that uncle? <laughs> ah. Oh, very funny. Oh, look. This looks like a decent Civilization. Woo. Other people. Finally. Look at all that snow on the mountains. I mean, yeah, the mountain view is pretty cool. I don't want to be back up there. You think we should have asked Molly to come with us? Oh, no. Miss O'Shea is far too high and mighty now for the likes of us. <laughs> or to do any real work. She's a society lady now. No, oh, is she now? Here, down the main street. Chairs always on the right. Sure, you can pick up some bounties there, Arthur. Bounties? I like the sound of that. Let's not run this man over. Yeah, well, that's a young man's game. <laughs> Ooh, yes. We can get up to some mischief here, all right. I like Let's the sound remember, of mischief. Keep a low profile. Will you remember that, though, Arthur? I probably oh, won't. Let's not. be honest. Let's park up down the end there, near the stables. Okay. Okay. Let's not run into these folk. Hi, guys. How's it going? Just gonna. I'm just gonna park my park my uh, wagon here. Here we are, just like I said, the cultural center of civilization. <laughs> Man at its finest. Uncle, what are we doing? Yeah, what are we doing? We're gonna do what any self-respecting maniac does. Put the women to work. <laughs> With pleasure. We'll start at the saloon. All right, okay, to the saloon we go. Trouble. Don't get yourselves noticed. Right. I need to get something from the stores. Okay. Well, we'll see uh -huh. you at the general store when you're done. Come on, ladies. Imagine okay. So what? What am I doing? Oh, follow so an uncle. All right. Cool. See yourself, is it? A maniac? Well, in my youth, I used to be known as the one-shot kid. There are several reasons okay. that could be. None of them good. I'm not gonna ask why. <laughs> you are a sad man, Arthur Morgan. Hey now. But I know you love me. Eh. Desperately. You're my favorite parasite. <laughs> no. Ringworm's my favorite parasite. You're my second favorite parasite. <laughs> Very funny. <laughs> I, I like I that. Lied. Ringworm. Then rats with the plague. Then you. 
Shut <laughs> up. <laughs> this is the place now. Come on. Uh, Arthur's fun. Morning. Howdy, folks. Oh my God, I have fifty dollars. So, what do you need? Hell, a drop of whiskey for a start. Mm -hmm. You know, something to pass the time while we're waiting on the women. Always thinking ahead, ain't you? Why don't you pick out a cigar? Okay. A cigar always focuses the mind, I find. What do you say? Well, you seem a little scattered, Arthur. Trust old uncle. I don't know if I, I do. Know if you have any questions, fellers. Okay, so apparently I can buy stuff shelf. straight from the shelves or from the shopkeep. I'm gonna go to the shopkeep because I don't trust myself looking at the shelves. I'll probably look at the wrong thing. Hi! Browse the catalog. Oh my god, sell. You not I have things. Anything, Arthur? Uh, Hold on a moment. Know. Maybe. I've got... What is this? Sauté de fowl. Oh, he probably only buys certain things, won't he? So... Yeah, yes, those are the only things he'll buy. Us. Oh, I was hoping I could sell you these things. Right. See this? Well, Don't folk so got no respect for their elders no more. I already got two cigars. Why do you want me to... A lamb or a sausage? Hmm. Well, this here's a sheep town. The lamb's the best in the state. Oh, no, lamb is good. Is. Lamb is good. Well, you know what? I'm going to sell these right. two cigars to then buy a cigar. <laughs> I'll probably lose money on the whole venture, but... Go with it. I don't want them anyways. So, pack. Well, look at this. And then... Browse catalog. This list of yours? I got a lot Ooh, to replenish after that god awful time in the mountains. All done. Thank you kindly. Okay, okay, so, um. <laughs> this should do the trick. Oh my god, there's all yep. sorts of things. That's uh, fine. next page. That should do us. Canned food, fresh food, outside. liquor, tobacco. Let's go to the tobacco. <laughs> okay, and we want a cigar. Yep, I sold two to buy one. <laughs> Worthless. All the best, fellas. Cool, I'm out. Seems to be lots of other things here, though. Uh, let's actually one more back. Uh, back this way. Uh, hunting and fishing, you say? There's also clothing. Alright, so we got arrows. Nice. Cover scent lotion. Herbivore bait. I like this. Kind of an amusing way to do shopping. Hmm. Alright. I think I'm good, though. Okay, I have to briefly look at what clothing offers, uh, things they offer. Yo, what do we got? Well, let's just look straight at outfits for now. We got the Vagero for $85. What the crap? Holy, the Valentine, what the? All right, these are way too expensive. I need more money. Oh, I can buy a Trilby hat. Hold on, go back. I saw that. Nice. <laughs> Alright, yeah, I'm out. Yeah, I need more money. I need a lot more money. Oh god, I gotta back out again, and then again. There we go. Thank you. You're a ripoff. <laughs> Alright, where's Uncle? Out we go. Hey! Oh, here's to your good health, sir. Thank you, <laughs> thank, thank you. Thank you for sharing. That mountain. Absolutely. It's a funny world, you know. This time in my career, I pictured myself being married to an heiress. Huh? <laughs> heiress? You? Really? We took like two swigs. I think I got something good. What? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I snuck into this fancy house. Why now? Acted like a servant girl. Usually works. Someone was saying her sister was taking a trip from New York or someplace. Train full of rich tourists heading to San Dene and then cruising off to Brazil. Okay. A train laden with baggage and passing through a bit of deserted country at night as to get to the docks in time for the tides in some place called Scarlet Meadows. Yeah, I know it. Yeah, yeah, it's right out near New Hanover. <laughs> right, it's real quiet out there. Sounds good. Uh -huh. Where's Tilly and Karen? Uh, I think at the hotel. Uh -huh. They were picking up some drunken fellas that they was gonna rob. Why? <laughs> Seemed easy. They have been gone for quite a while. I guess I'll go see if there's any trouble. Alright, let's just save there's those ladies. Over there. That does not look ideal. It does not. Excuse me. Time to go beat a fool. Alright. Oh, it looks like his friends. You can go kiss a damn snake for all I care. Get hey there, me. fella. Of me. Stranger. I've been Diffuse. Get your hands off me, mm. friend. 
Who are you? A friend of mine. Get off her. <laughs> Am I gonna have to punch you? I'm gonna have to punch you, aren't I? Who would exactly? I'll punch you. You wanna find out? Well. You're making a big mistake, Tilly Jackson. Just get Wait. lost. He knows her full name. I ain't doing this with you. Go right away with Uncle and Mary Beth. They're across the street. Why do you know okay. your full name? Thanks, Arthur. Why would you tell him your full name? Is that someone from your past? Look after her. All right, now I gotta go inside to help arrest. All right, Karen, where are you at? I do all I can manage. Are you doing? Yeah, where, where is she? Where is she? Where am I looking? All right, over here. Uh, in here. Oh, sorry, buddy. Sorry. Oh, oh boy. Uh, you know, I'm just gonna go skip to the end room. That is not an end room. Uh, it was this room. I can clearly hear the noise. Kick it. Boom. Hey, howdy. A friend of hers. Get out of here, buddy. I paid. Ain't paid a hitter, you goddamn animal. Come Time to punch, man. There we go. That was easy. Well, I mean, while we're here. <laughs> Apparently not, lady. Apparently not. Fine. You sure? Yeah. Nothing. Nothing to worry about. Just uh -huh. men. But stupid bastard. Stupid bastard was boasting about the bank. The bank? Sure, I know small town banks are usually a waste of time, but this is a livestock town. There's lots of cash sometimes. Uh huh. Okay. So we got a potential for a Keep bank job me. and a train job. Interesting. I was hoping maybe there I could get into the. Um... Oh my god, I can! I just couldn't when she was talking. <gasps> I'm stealing his stuff. Man, dude's got nothing. All right, fine. Jeez. <laughs> Search the drawer. No. Nope. No. Oh man! All right, I looted off his body at least. There we go. I'm gonna leave him open. He, he already knows someone was here. I I decked the dude. I hope, Super good. Uh, everything's okay up there. Oh yeah, Peachy. Just Peachy. Let's not show our face in here again. Thank you, Arthur. Uh huh. I don't much like being saved, but when I have to be. I understand. Keep a knife on you, lady. You okay? Sure. He only punched me. Arthur punched him a lot harder. <laughs> yeah, did. Right, no. hey, Good times. Who's that guy over there looking at us? Weren't you in Blackwater a few weeks back? Me? No, sir. Ain't from there. Oh, you were. Well, I definitely saw you with a bunch of fellers. Me? No. Uh, I'm gonna have to kill a fool. Listen, buddy. Come here for a minute. I saw you. Come here. Cool. Get. I don't have my horse. I don't like this. I'm gonna steal someone else's horse, aren't I? We'll get the girls home. I'm yep, gonna go steal someone's horse. Our friend. Be careful, Arthur. Just a word. Yeah. Whose horse am I stealing? Oh, I'm sorry. Didn't mean to steal your horse. Get back here right now. Oh, he went through that way, huh? All right, I probably shouldn't have gone through the way I did. Oh well. Oh well. This is not a great horse. Oh God, he's over there now. I don't see the man. Oh, there he is. There he is. Also, I'm going to have to... Uh, just, oh, boy. This is not a great horse. This is not a great horse. Oh, he's, he's dead. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Hi. Hi. I'm going to question you first. Why yeah. are you telling lies about me? No. No, I, I, I got it wrong, partner. I got it very wrong. Now, please help me up. All right. I ain't never been in black water. Yeah, then never why been. Are you chasing me. I've got an unfortunate face. Yes, <laughs> yes, me too. Now, please pull me up, please. Oh, please. fine. I'll help him. It'd be easier All to right. kill him, but there we go. Come on. Just keep your mouth shut now. You owe me. Life debt and all. You okay, partner? Yay, honor. No. 
Well, you're no, the one who I'm stupidly not. went off a cliff. I'm a mess. Well, you ain't dead. There is that. Mm hmm. And you want to keep it that way. I think it's best for both of us if we pretend this never happened. Mm hmm. Well, I agree. You saved my life. I did. You're a good man, and I, uh, here. You want a pen? It's one of them steel ones. Sure. Yeah. I'd be happy if he just never mentioned Blackwater again. But I'm not a good man, Jimmy Brooks. Not usually. You see, I was in Blackwater. I just say I that. I kill people. Oh, okay, to intimidate. Yeah, and sure. maybe I should have killed you. Should I have killed you, Jimmy Brooks? Me? Now that I know your name, and we'll find I you. I never saw you. Not, not now. Not, not never. Good man. I think we have an understanding. We do. Of course we, we do. do. Jimmy Brooks. <laughs> I will remember that. Mm -hmm. I've got a good memory. Good thing you do, because I sure as heck don't. Oh, auto save. Oh, yeah, my own thing. Oh, yeah, yeah, just save over it. I don't care. <laughs> I haven't. Not, mm -hmm. not one lick. Not one sense in this year old mind. Yep. Good. <laughs> Good. Come on. Come on. We finished the mission. A horse blip with that is your temporary horse. Should I return the horse? I should probably return the horse. Uh, hi, horse. You can return the horse you stole to its owner to gain honor. Okay, yeah, let's do that. Where's his owner? <laughs> I mean, back in town. I'm just gonna go back to where I uh, stole it from. All right, there we go. There we go. Over here. Over here. Back into town. Is it that white symbol there? I don't know. Hey, my horse! Up. Oh. Am I glad to see you? And me too. Here's your horse back, friend. Sorry about that. Oh, you really were just borrowing. I it. was. Appreciate it. Cool. <laughs> oh, apparently plants I can pick can be highlighted in eagle eye. Oh god, how do I use that again? I remember dead eye. What's eagle eye? Uh-oh. What is it that? It's that. <laughs> it's the same thing. Ah, uh, it's the same thing as dead eye. Cool. It's just dead eyes when I aim. Awesome. Awesome. Well, I mean we completed a mission, which is my usual way of ending. Oh wait, we haven't completed the mission though, have we? Wait, what's this? Is this a new mission? Because it said we completed the one thing for Uncle. Oh, this is the Javier one. Oh, yeah. Forgot about that. That's what we're going to do next time. And what is this? Stranger. Yeah, we're, we're going to help with Javier. But that's going to be it for next episode. So what is this? Oh, the bounty hunting. Oh, my God. Yes, we are going to do some bounty hunting. Later, though. Tomorrow. Or actually, yes, it will be tomorrow when you guys see it. But Americans at rest. As yeah, told you that Javier, Bill, and Charles were already in Valentine. All right. We will do that next time. But that is going to be it for today, folks. A little bit short of an episode compared to the other ones we've had here recently. But, uh, yeah, hopefully you have enjoyed. You do come back for the next. But until that time, thank you for watching. And as always, have a good one.